and Amy, just a few hours ago, U.S. Customs and Border Patrol shut down the San Ysidro port of entry between San Diego and Tijuana. No one from either side can currently cross over. This is the scene in Tijuana today. Thousands of troops and agents were called out ahead of the planned demonstrations at the border. Earlier, hundreds in the caravan were peacefully protesting, urging officials to hear their asylum claims. That's when a small group broke off and rushed toward the fence, separating the two countries. Officers then reportedly hurled tear gas over from the U.S. side. Those who attempted to get onto U.S. soil were stopped and turned back to Mexico by police. About an hour ago, U.S. Customs and Border Protection tweeted this. Today, several migrants threw projectiles at the agents in San Diego. Border Patrol agents deployed tear gas to dispel the group because of the risk to agent safety. Several agents were hit by the projectiles. The situation is evolving and a statement is forthcoming. U.S. Homeland Security Secretary Christian Nielsen tweeted a statement in response to the border chaos, saying in part, the DHS will not tolerate this type of lawlessness and will not hesitate to shut down the port of entries for security reasons. We'll seek to prosecute to the fullest extent of the law anyone who destroys federal property, endangers our frontline operators, or violates our sovereignty. Meanwhile, President Trump has threatened to shut down the government if Congress does not agree to pay for a border wall. The federal government is funded through December 7th. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Lorraine.